So I just noticed, looking into the viewfinder, that my face looks different than the rest of my body. But I'm also in different lighting. I swear, in natural light, it does not look like this. Hey Mountain Family, how's it going? So I've seen a lot of those Get Ready With Me vlogs and I really like them, but if you will notice really quickly, you will see that my name is Kristen Hall Vlogs, not Kristen Hall Does Makeup. So if you want beauty tips or what palette to buy or what brushes are good, I am not your hero. You do not want those tips from me. But I don't care to show you guys what I do and what my routine is. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and get into this video. So real quick, before we get to makeup, let's do a quick review of my hair. I have this part pulled up and the rest is down and straightened. This is my go-to mommy look because this is what I have time for. It used to be a constant ponytail all the time, 24-7, but my youngest, Andy, is getting older. She's like eight months old now, so I'm starting to get a little bit more time to actually do something with this. So right now, it is this. So the first thing I'm gonna do is prime my face with this hard candy primer it is green because I get red right here like throughout my like under eye nose area so I need something green to like balance it out and to be honest I don't like this product at all I just like the fact that it's green and it at least somewhat kind of makes the redness go away. I need to find a new product. I really do. I just haven't had the time to look for one yet. This is really hard to massage into my face, but I'm going to try like I do pretty much every time I put on makeup. is so silky that it's like all over my hands and it's still not rubbed in. Now that my face is sort of primed but not really, I'm going to use this CoverGirl True Blend and this is in the shade Way Too Pale. And I'm going to take my Bare Minerals Perfecting Face Foundation Brush. It's got a little like I don't know if you can see it. It has a little pool right there where you can put your foundation and then you just put it on your face. I got this in a BoxyCharm box last month and I love it. I use it all the time now. So I'm just going to put some foundation on my brush and go to town. Okay, now that I've smeared two coats of that foundation on my face to try to make it look as even as possible, really need to get new foundation because I've had this for over a year now and I just haven't gotten new foundation yet because I'm terrible at buying makeup products, hence why I have my BoxyCharm subscription because it just comes in the mail and that's so much easier. They don't send foundation so I do kind of need to get some more of that. But now I'm going to try to cover up the bags under my eyes so it can at least look like I've gotten 10 minutes of sleep. And I'm going to use this Glamouflage by Hard Candy. Another Hard Candy product that I don't like. It doesn't really work that well, but it's all I've got right now, so it's what I use. <laughs> Okay, so now that I've tried to at least halfway cover up the bags under my eyes, I'm now going to use this e.l.f. High Definition Powder, and mostly I just use this because it takes the shine off my face. That's basically why I use it. <laughs> Moving on to brows, I'm using this MAC Eyebrow Pencil in brown and I use this little brush thingy to comb it out. Did you all see how dirty it is? I hope you don't judge me for my dirty brush. 
I got this in a BoxyCharm box last month. Love it. At first I didn't like it because I was like, oh, that's really skinny. But it's kind of grown on me and now I use it pretty much every time. <laughs> I'm very simple when it comes to eye makeup on mom days. I only have three brushes to my name. I have two applique, did I say that right? I don't know if I said that right. Brushes, a crease brush I'm assuming, and I think the other one is a crease brush. I don't know. I don't know what that is. I am using this Pure Soiree Diaries palette, which I got from BoxyCharm last month. It's so pretty. Let me show y'all. The colors are gorgeous. Okay, so now I'm gonna try to do what those girls in makeup videos do. Here we go. And now for the last step of my this is what I have time to do because I have kids mom look mascara. It has no name. There is no label at all because I've had this forever. <laughs> I need new makeup you guys. I didn't realize how bad it was until this video. So let's put the makeup that is way too old on my eyelashes. <music> Is the completed look. Half of my makeup I don't like and half of my makeup doesn't work. <laughs> and basically the only makeup I do like was given to me by BoxyCharm. Gosh, I don't mean to be talking about BoxyCharm a lot. No, this was not sponsored by them. <laughs> I just really like the makeup that they've given me. <laughs> and because practically every makeup tutorial thing I've ever watched ends with this, I might as well do it too. <laughs>